Amen? Amen. 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 All right, well, God is awesome. You hear all these different instruments up here? We're all playing them together, so it sounds like one full sound. So we want to talk to you a little bit and sort of talk to you about what we do when we um, do sort of an educational show on concert at schools. I want to talk to you a little bit about the different instruments you hear up here. All right, within the orchestra, how many different families of instruments are in the orchestra? Anybody? Four. four. I see a four. Yeah, six. All right. There's four families up here. What would one of the families be? Brass. 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 Strings. Brass. Percussion. Brass. And woodwinds. Excellent. All right, is there anyone you want to hear from first? Brass. I heard woodwinds first. Okay. Woodwinds wins out tonight. Okay, so how many woodwinds are in the woodwind family? That's strings. That's the, that's the next group, okay? All right, so we have five. What would the five be? Clarinet. I heard clarinet. What else? Saxophone. Good. Obo. Flute. We're missing one. We're missing one. No, oh, that's brass. That's brass. Piccolo. Piccolo is part of the flutes. Good. We'll get to that one too. Okay, we'll save this other one because a lot of you guys don't get it. It's a, special, it's a special woodwind. Okay? So let's hear from some of these woodwind specialists. Okay? We'll hear from the flute first. Okay? All right, and then have the piccolo ready too. So let's hear what the flute sounds like as a solo instrument all by itself. An instrument that was created to glorify God, right? Right. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so I heard oboe is another woodwind, right? So let's hear from the oboe. All right, very beautiful. Can you play, can you play uh, from the high note, like a scale going down? Uh, you sure? <laughs> All right, so I wanted to hear kind of that, the richness of the tone when it gets lower. All right, so the difference between those two instruments, they're both woodwinds, right? One's made out of wood, but the flute is not. The flute is actually made out of what? Brass. So kind of metal. This, and this particular one's silver, right? You have silver? Yeah, silver. You don't have fancy platinum? Oh, you have a gold on there, too. All right, so this one's made out of silver and gold. <laughs> okay, so, and, and then the flute, has a lip hole that you blow into, and when you blow it, how many have blown into a Coke bottle? Right? Either. Okay? That's how, essentially how you're creating the sound on the flute. Okay? You're breaking the air with the lip hole, and it has keys and figures. So all the woodwinds have keys um, that you push down. And the oboe uses a double reed. Okay? It uses two reeds that are small, and um, they vibrate together. Can you just buzz on a single reed, or the, your double reed? Okay, that's what the reed sounds like by itself. You put it on the end of the wooden instrument, and it gets the oboe sound. All right, so let's hear from the clarinet. The clarinet is a single reed instrument, and that means it has one reed that vibrates on a mouthpiece. Okay, so let's hear some clarinet. <laughs> Who's getting married in here? <laughs> oh, I don't, is that, is that new news? What? I don't know. It's news I didn't know about. Yeah. All right, so that's the clarinet. And we also have a friend of the clarinet. It's bigger brother. All right, we'll, we'll get to that one later. I promise. All right, and we have the bass clarinet. Can you hold the bass clarinet up so they can see it? Look out! <laughs> Now, he, he handles it pretty well, but let's see if he can play it. Oh. Oh. Very 
Okay, Bobby. I think you handled it just fine, don't you? Yeah. Anybody know the name of that song? <coughs> Anybody know the name of that song? Anybody heard it before? Yeah. Oh, you've heard it before. Nobody knows the name of it. Anybody know a composer that used it in his music? I was gonna give a CD out. Oh well, never mind. All right, so I promise we're gonna hear from the saxophones later. But now I want you to hear from the one that you guys could not guess. It's also a double reed instrument. It's bigger. It's sort of the bass instrument of the Woodman family. Can you hold it up, please? Anybody know what that is? Oh, of course. But so how can we forget about the bassoon? All right. The bassoon also uses a double reed, and you put it on the end. Can you hold it up again? Sorry. Just the instrument. Yeah. Alright, you see that little silvery thing that sticks out from there? It's called a vocal. And you stick the reed on there, and it, the double reed vibrates. And let, yeah, let's use some bassoon. So here it is. Uh, and this, um, also, the overture is normally a piece that's played at the beginning of an opera or a play. All right, and so it, a lot of times it encapsulates some of the melodies that you might hear. So this is more of a classical type piece. It's from the mid 1800s um, and the Viennese kind of style. This is called Die Fledermaus. Die Fledermaus! Yes, which is the flying mouse, which means the bat. The bat. <laughs> 